This video is sponsored by Merch. Sir, since you are in an emergency exit row, would you be able and willing to assist in the event of an emergency? Yeah, no problem. All right, everybody, listen the fuck up. We have commandeered this plane. I think I'm using that right. And you all might be interested in knowing that in one hand, I hold the detonator to the bomb that's located in the back of the plane. So I suggest you pay close attention. Now, who's in charge out there? Yes, right here, uh, Zach has said that he is able and willing to assist. Perfect, how do we talk to him? Oh, here, one sec. All right, Zach, we know you can hear us. So, we want you to get us one billion dollars in the next three hours, or we will blow this entire plane. Oh, hey, we're having a medical emergency back here. Oh, medical emergency. Hey, Zach? Zach! Everybody clear the aisle so Zach can get through? No, I don't care if you're a doctor. You didn't say you were able and willing to assist. Now, back up! This is the police. We have the aircraft surrounded. Now, we don't want anyone getting hurt. So we're gonna have our hostage negotiation team call in to negotiate. Whoever is in charge, please pick up. Hello? Oh, yeah, let me put you through to Zach. Here you go, Zach. Hey, Zach, I've just been briefed that you are able and willing to assist with the situation we found ourselves in. Now know that no matter what happens, you're a hero. I've personally never been able or willing to sit in an emergency exit row because I just wouldn't be very able or willing to help. Like, leave that to the pros, right? But that's not your mentality, and that's what makes you a hero. Now, we need you to continue to stall the commandeers until we can get them the ransom money. Wait one sec. Hey, who are you guys? Agent Roberts, FBI, and we're in charge now. Says who? This is a federal matter, which means we have jurisdiction. Well, I answer to a higher power. Like who? Zach, the one who is not only able, but willing to save everybody. Does the president know about this? Mr. President, I've just received word that aliens are approaching Earth. Are we talking E.T. aliens or Independence Day aliens? Independence Day. So the mean ones. Super mean. There's not a single weapon in our arsenal that would be able and willing to defeat an army of Independence Day aliens. I know, sir. But a young man named Zack has said that he is not only able, but willing to assist in the event of an emergency. Well, if this isn't an emergency, I don't know what is. I need to address the nation. My fellow Americans, I regret to inform you that aliens are approaching our planet. And these aliens are like the ones from Independence Day. <gasps> but luckily, Zach, from emergency exit row seat 12C, is both able and willing to take out this army of Independence Day aliens. Humans of planet Earth, we are the aliens that your president speaks of. And through the power of telepathy, I am able and willing to deliver this message. We come in peace. We only look like the aliens from Independence Day, but we're actually pretty chill. However, our universe is under attack from robot fire demons from another dimension. These robot fire demons will stop at nothing until they've taken over the entire multiverse. So we are building an army of intelligent life from our universe who have what it takes to defend what's ours. This is an emergency. So on your mental keypads, please vote now on who you think is the most able and willing to assist during this emergency. We are selecting the one they call Zack of C-12C to join our army. Woo! Woo! Let's go! Let's go! Zack, we will now take you to their leader. The fate of our universe rests in your hands. All right, Zach, we've set you up in one of our most advanced hyperspace fighters that is able and willing to reach speeds of over 100 times the speed of light. 
allowing you to hyper tunnel through the higher temporal dimensions. This is the only way we're gonna win. God willing and God able. Okay, here comes the drop point. Good luck, Zach. You're approaching their leader now. my power. This guy isn't even gonna know what hit him. Oh shit, it's Zack from C-12C, just as the prophecy foretold. He's right, Zack. I didn't want to believe it, but the Bible says that before he takes flight, the Chosen One will reveal himself in C-12C. He will be holy and righteous, able and willing, and through his strength and able willingness, the multiverse shall be able and willing to live in harmony. This is your destiny, Zack. But no one has ever been capable or capable willing of defeating me. Zack, the hyperthrusters that will allow you to create a dual time loop between our universe and theirs should be fully charged in five, four, 